Okay guys, so here we have the Tough Jets T14, it's an F14 clone. It's pretty durable, it's made out of EPP foam and core plast, uh, which is like a plastic cardboard, you can see. I have some damage on the nose. It's pretty durable, but once it breaks off, it just glues right back together. Battery hatch is right up here in the canopy. Um, I have a 2200 milliamp battery in there. Um, uh, I have a BP Hobbies uh, motor on it with a uh, master air screw 9x6 prop. Then on the bottom, it's just two servos set up for Elevon. And um, you can see I have a 30 amp, uh, 40 amp speed control. Um, and my receiver's right over there. It's a good flyer, flies pretty slow. So let's get flying. Here's the wind, kind of that way. Mm -hmm. Nice landing. I don't know what happened up there. But I don't know. I just tried to turn it. I was giving it full power and it wasn't turning. It also does inverted very well. Oh no, no, no! Oh, I know, oh. I know up! I was giving it full up and it wasn't turning. I'm like, no, no, no. Oh, that, that was bad. That was the pieces bad. went flying. I was pulling full up and nothing happened. I'm like, no. I don't know what happened. We'll find out soon. <laughs> Debris field. <laughs> I don't like seeing yellow. Oh, uh, what's the yellow for? <laughs> Canopy shattered. Oh, that's bad. Uh, 
Let's see. I can turn this off. The plane's off. Uh, here are some more parts. Here's the build. What is that? Is that the... Oh. Where's the battery? I gotta have to find that. Here's the... Oh, this is already the inlet. The, uh, intake. Or mock intake. Oh. 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 Uh, see. I'm scared to see what it looks like. Oh. I ejected the receiver. <laughs> I broke this off. That goes right in there. Part of the nose, it's part of the canopy, there's the other part. Let's look at the battery. Found it. Where's the battery? Right oh, jeez. Oh, put a nice little ditch in the ground. <laughs> that, little impression where the battery was. Like oh, look at that. That's the impression where the battery landed right there. There's like an eight foot ejection radius. Well, as you can see, the nose fits right back. Everything just fits right back together. I'm going to have to... Is that another piece over, over there? Is that a piece? Oh. Oh, I found the other part of the canopy. So I split the canopy in three, <laughs> three places. <laughs> That's... Oh, I'm missing a piece. Well, it must be around. one's stripped. You can hear it. Oh, wow, it doesn't even go down. It has no down only. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, that one's unplugged. So, I don't know. Something went wrong. And I tried... I tried to pull up. There's no avail. Are you missing a piece of the camera? Like the motor when it hit it shook around because it cut there, it cut there, it cut there, and it cut a servo wire completely, oh. completely separated. It. So I don't know. I don't know if that was a result of the crash or that happened because when I was going down, I felt like I didn't have um, one of my servos. I don't know. That might have just been from the crash. So yeah, just uh, two servos are down, but they were the cheap Hobby King ones, like those. Five dollar one. 